What's up, YouTube? Welcome to Naija and Clifton Mecca's channel. I'm Naija, and welcome back again. I'm glad that you guys have subscribed to my channel. I'm and if you guys haven't, go ahead and do it. Anyway, this is like a part three, part three, probably part three. To um, for those of you who have been following me, y'all know that I've been wanting to put in my two week notice for my job, and um. You know, I'm just going through a lot of stuff that I haven't really explained um, fully on camera. I'm not ready to expose so much information, but I put in a lot of information. If you want to know the backstory on that, check out part one and part two. I'll try to link it in the description below. But um, so, so this is what happened, y'all. This is what happened. All right. So the day I was going in to put in my tube notice, I got, I, I went in. And um, I typed up my letter. I was about to send the letter, and I got an email from the human resources. Uh, well, she's a talent acquisition manager about the interview for a position that I put in for like a while ago for the same company. And I was just like, oh, it's more money. Um, it's kind of up the avenue of what I want to do in the meantime until I establish my own business. Um, and I was like, uh, what the heck? Might as well go for it, right? So I didn't wind up putting in my two-week notice. But think, all right, so the next day after that was actually was the actual interview. So I went on the, the same day I, I emailed my I emailed the supervisor. I don't try to, he's not mine. And I let I said I need to be at such and such at 10 30 a.m. And then he was like, okay, and then he was like are you asking me or are you telling me? And I'm just like, what kind of question is that? So I didn't answer it back. So anyway, um, because he, he's the one that put in for the transfer advance, advancement in the first place. So to ask me a question like that, I don't know. See, this is why I don't think that I'm supposed to be in jobs. Because I, to me, that seems like a silly question. No, a stupid ass question you don't watch my channel anyway. if you do oh well anyway um so all right so i went to the interview it went so well i feel like it went so well like i feel like i got the interview i feel like i nailed it really like it was two um people interviewing one was taking notes the other one was asking questions i mean i had them i mean i feel like i had them right and so um I left feeling good about it and everything like that. Walked out the building, because I was actually in another building. Um, I had to go back to work and I had to go to another building. And I get a text message from him saying something about, oh, good luck on your interview, but why you ain't tell me that's insubordination, that could be considered bad work work ethic, blah, 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 blah. And I was just like, you gotta be kidding me. You put in the transfer advancement, you you said it was okay and then you won't ask me a question it's like do you want me to beg it's like what am i doing what am i doing did he sabotage my opportunity to advance and i'm like i don't know like what y'all think do you think he sabotaged the opportunity because um they told me that they're gonna be picking somebody immediately um well, not they said they didn't use the word immediately. They used the word um, what they use as soon as possible. They're gonna pick somebody quickly because the position's been open for a while, and I know that because I've been waiting to get interviewed for a while. I've been bugging the talent acquisition manager for a while, so um, I was like, okay, so I know. And this happened all I think last Thursday, so it's now Monday. I don't know if I'll put this out, but it's now Monday the twentieth. And I haven't heard anything back since then. The supervisor texted me that stuff the, that same Thursday right after the interview was over. And after that, I was just like, I'm so through. Like, I feel like he probably sabotaged my opportunity to advance. Um, and it, it just probably meant for me to, like, really quit. Like, really put in my two-week notice. Like, because I feel like that was a sign. Like, if I haven't got the call by now, it's like... I didn't get it because I 
obviously he said something because I know my interview was bombed. I'm telling you, I got promoted. I've been in that company two years. I got promoted like one, two, from where? From a regular associate to management to um, uh, employment trainer to like, um, so that's twice. And I always got it. I always got it. I'm always, I always get it. Like, I'm just so confident. I'm so good in interviewing. Like, I'm like, I just know everything to say. And I, I feel like I nailed it. I really feel like I nailed it. And I really feel like he sabotaged my chances. Because first of all, when I first told him about it, did I just spit? Anyway, when I first told him about it, he was like, he didn't want me to go for no tr transfer advancement. Okay, because he's a hater. But anyway, he was like, oh, you got to stay in position more than such such amount of months, whatever. And I'm just like, to me, in my head, I'm like, that's a bunch of BS because when I first got promoted, I was not in my position no six months. And the, my man, the manager that I was under um, did not let me wait because it's not no guarantee you're going to get it anyway. But anyway. When it, that's all. That's all said and done. That's all said and done. Um, I, I'm like overthinking this, overthinking this. I'm like, you know what? I'm, I'm silly. I'm putting too much energy into this position. Too much energy into this, to this situation. Too much energy to this person. And I'm like, it's. I feel like all the signs are pointing to me. Just saying, just let it go. You know, just let it go. Move on. Just putting into notice and just really focus on. YouTube, if that's what you want to do, focus on your business, focus on yourself and your branding and everything like that. So I don't know what you guys think. Like, should I just should I be more patient? Do you think he sabotaged me? Um, or go for your dreams? I don't know. It don't even matter because it's really ultimately up to me. Whatever I choose, what I feel like is right for me and and my family. And I don't know, but. I guess we'll have a part four and let you know what happened. Did I send that to a notice? Did I get the position? I'll let you know in the next video. So don't forget to subscribe. Hit the notification bell. Hit that like button. Share. Do all the things that YouTube got us doing now. And sometimes, you know, you still don't be getting the notifications. And you still asking for all the notifications. And you still don't get no notifications. And you wondering what's YouTube doing. And you're like, yo, I got to look for the this person because I want to know what's going on it's you know but anyway I'm rambling deuce out deuces peace blessings